surveillance uh, here domestically. Uh, CNN Chief National Security Correspondent Jim Shudo uh, is here. Jim, I have to say, this, these provisions are set to expire Sunday night, midnight. Um, I have covered President Obama since he was Senator Obama. I've seen him campaign for himself. I have seen him campaign for other people. I have seen him campaign for legislation. This is the selling job for something he says is vital to protect American people? A pool spray on Friday afternoon? Yeah, no, and li listen, it hasn't been very sharp since the beginning, because you remember even going back to when Edward Snowden first revealed the phone metadata problem uh, program, which really led to this whole controversy. You know, the message has changed from the White House. Early on, you remember this talking point? 50 terror plots thwarted by this program. That number... A talking point disappeared because yeah. actually it wasn't demonstrated by the facts. I mean, it was watered down to one guy who sent 8,500 bucks to Somalia that was specifically netted in the metadata program. And this is one of the criticisms that has led to the opposition here is that there are other tools that the NSA and U.S. intelligence can use to nab these guys other than phone metadata. That's the most controversial of these. There are other ones that are less controversial. The president referred to them, for instance, this roving cell phone power, uh, because, uh, you know, one of the troubles is, you know, these guys are smart enough to switch their cell phone numbers and kind of constantly change them because they know that the NSA is listening, uh, and that's something that's less controversial. Metadata, more controversial. The president mentions that they have a fix in there. They're going to basically move the metadata from the government's hands, keep it in the phone company's, the phone hands, company's hands, and then right. the government would have to use a, a warrant to, to, to get in there. And, and the trouble is, though, that message has been kind of mixed in all this because some of these should be pretty easy selling points, particularly when you and I are talking every day about the threat of ISIS and but, plots here in the U.S. Right. Uh, that's, what yeah. I don't, that's really what I don't understand is that the, they have the tools of uh, the head of the CIA, the head of the National Security Agency, the head of the, the director of national intelligence, all these people, Loretta Lynch, who could be on television all day, all week, talking about the need for these programs, and I haven't seen them. I guess I think Loretta Lynch did an interview last week, but that's about it. Anyway, no, I'm, I'm with you on that. I think they probably imagined that they would all come around, and lo and behold, they haven't come around. And now we're, what, 48 hours from the, exactly. out, the deadline? All right. CNN Chief National Security Correspondent.